Hi everybody, it's Miss Lindsay, and this is the story of the three little pigs. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs who lived in the woods. There were two brothers and a sister. A big bad wolf lived in the woods too. So one day, the three little pigs set off to find new homes. Soon, the three little pigs saw a pile of straw. I'll build my house with straw, said the first little pig. The two little pigs walked on. They saw a pile of sticks. I'll build my house with sticks, said the second little pig. The third little pig walked on. She saw a pile of bricks. I'll build a strong house with bricks, said the third little pig. It took her a very long time. Her brothers laughed at her for working so hard, but her house of bricks was very strong. The very next day, the big bad wolf came to the house of straw. He was dressed as an old woman. Little pig, little pig, let me in, said the wolf. But the first pig saw that it was the wolf. He said, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. The little pig ran away. He hid with his brother in his house of sticks. The next day, the big bad wolf came to the house of sticks. He was dressed as a sheep. Little pig, little pig, let me in, said the wolf. But the second little pig saw that it was the wolf. And he said, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. So the two little pigs ran away. They hid with their sister in her house of bricks. But the next day, the big bad wolf came to the house of bricks. Little pig, little pig, let me in, said the wolf. And the third little pig said, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed but he could not blow the house down. Let me in, cried the wolf. But the third little pig still would not let him in. The big bad wolf climbed into the chimney. The first two little pigs hid under the table. The big bad wolf slid down the chimney. The first two little pigs shut their eyes. Then splash, the big bad wolf fell into the hot pot of water. Splash! Help! Help! cried the wolf. He jumped out of the pot and ran out of the house. The three little pigs jumped for joy. They never saw that big bad wolf again. The end. So I have a few things that I found around my house and I thought it would be fun to make little houses like the pigs did and see which one that the wolf could not blow over. Does anybody remember what the first little pig used to make their house? You're right, the first little pig used straw to make their house. Hmm, I think these straws right here would be a good idea to use. So let's see, I'm just gonna stack them up and see. Whoop. So what do you think is going to happen when he huffs and he puffs and he blows his house in? Do you think the straw house is going to blow away or do you think it's still going to stand? Let's see. Ready? Oh no! Our straw house blew right over. So what did the second little pig build his house with? That's right, he used sticks to build his house. Let's see what happens when we use the sticks. Are we ready? 
Ready? It blew over. So the third little pig, she used bricks to build her house. Let's see what happens when we use bricks. our brick house. Do you think it's going to blow over? Me either. Let's see. You were right. Our brick house didn't blow over.